Billionaire Tony Tan Kaktiong, the controlling shareholder of Philippines fast food giant Jollibee Foods, has again teamed up with real estate tycoon Ed Garcia, with their latest plan about creating the Philippines' first industrial real estate investment trust that will be listed next year. The duo are joining the country's biggest property developers, including Philinvest Land, Megaworld and Robinsons Land, which are preparing to raise some 69 billion pesos $1.4 billion from initial public offerings in the coming months. The two tycoons are already partners in Double Dragon, which is partly owned by Tan Kaktiong. The developer raised 14.7 billion pesos from the market debut of office landlord DDMPREIT in March. In a statement, Sears Double Dragon said its industrial property leasing subsidiary Central Hub Industrial Centers signed an agreement of almost 4 billion pesos with Jollibee. Under the agreement, Jollibee will inject 16.4 hectares square meters of industrial properties currently used as commissaries in exchange for shares in Central Hub, Double Dragon said. Including the Jollibee assets, Central Hub will have an industrial portfolio totaling 39.8 hectares, making it the country's largest industrial REIT. These properties are suitable as warehouses, commissaries, cold storage facilities and logistics distribution centers. Central Hub will become a major recurring income contributor to Double Dragon, said Sia, 44, Double Dragon chairman. An aspiring architect, Sia dropped out of college to set up barbecue chicken restaurant chain Mang Inazel, which he sold to Jollibee in 2012. He took Double Dragon public in 2014. With a net worth of $700 million, he was ranked no. 21 when the Philippines Rich List was published in September 2020. The latest partnership with Sia will provide Jollibee a vehicle to raise funds to finance its expansion plans in the Philippines and overseas. We will use the proceeds from the eventual IPO of Central Hub to finance real estate investments for our new stores and commissaries which we will convert again into more investments and shares in the REIT, Tan Kaktiong said in a separate statement. Basically, the REIT will help continuously finance our future expansion. Tan Kaktiong, 68, told the shareholders last month about plans to open 450 new stores this year and another 500 outlets next year in the Philippines and beyond. Jollibee now operates more than 3,200 outlets in the Philippines and over 2,500 overseas, including US-based chains Smashburger and Coffee Bean. He and his family were ranked the 11th richest profile from the Philippines in the World Billionaires list published in April with a net worth of $2.4 billion.